So I was looking for pictures of hostages to show you from the Israeli and Palestinian side. And I came across this 17 year old Mia who was released today from the Israeli side. And, uh, and I was like, why is she holding a dog? And then the article, that's her dog. And her dad thought her dog was missing from day one when she was kidnapped. And uh, she somehow convinced Hamas to bring her dog with her. Uh, I just picture like, hey, hey, can I please take my dog? You know, or he's got medication. He'll, he'll be bad without me. Like, sure, let's, let's bring your dog with you. Sounds like a great idea. And then I'm like, as they try to keep them hidden, like, for, do they have like a, maybe that's what that calendar was, the least. There is a list. This list. Uh, maybe there was a calendar of dog who had the shift of taking the dog out to walk or go to the bathroom, like, you know, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, all that. And uh, so maybe that's what it was. So, uh, this is gonna be hard for like IDF to paint this horrible picture with this. Like first we have that Maya girl looking all googly eyes to Hamas, and now we got now they're like taking care of animals for these kids. So very interesting <laughs> to say the least. But I totally know like Mr. Least is going to uh, he's gonna talk about how the savages stole kidnapped dogs too. But uh, like no, they they let him take care of her dog. So good on them. Good on you, Hamas. I never thought I'd say that, but like, wait, let this girl have her dog. Now I want to show you an operational tunnel. The tunnel is built with electricity. We first saw the solar panels, then the electricity goes here. And it goes down directly to the tunnel.